Hi guys. So, um, um, I want to start a, a new uh, movement in uh, NXT. Um, I'm not sure how exactly, but I would like to like really try to realize not to do NXT 2.0 the way Jean-Luc is proposing it currently by splitting up NXT into two coins. Um, I don't think it's the right uh, uh, right uh, direction. Um, I have been mixed uh, at first. I liked it. Then I, at first I didn't like it. Then I liked it. Uh, there are advantages, disadvantages, but I think it's not the right direction because of two reasons. Um, First of all, you do devalue NXT. Everybody agrees with that. By splitting it up in two coins, you uh, part of the value of NXT will go to the other coin. And um, that's bad for the asset exchange. Um, why? Because it's always the case when you see that in the fiat world, when in a certain country the, uh, the currency drops in value, then the in on the stock market the stock the stocks do go up but not as much as they should go up to compensate for the loss in the currency and so in during a hyperinflation for example when the when a currency loses a lot of value you will see that even though the stocks have gone up a lot in 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 that fiat value in real value compared to other currencies have gone down a lot and are cheaper than ever before so 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 I understand, and at first I wasn't really understanding, but I understand better the outrage by the asset, uh, uh, the, uh, the NXT asset co uh, assets community uh, that they are really not happy with that and that they want to um, be compensated. And as most N NXTers don't want to compensate, uh, they are currently fleeing. Um, it looks like it's it's like an exodus. Uh, and this is, unless NXT comes up with something else, this is suicide. Because for NXT, the only thing that has been attracting people to NXT that it is offering is the NXT Asset Exchange. That's the only thing that, 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 that worked out. But this is suicide for the Asset Exchange. So, but of course, we can choose to do that if we have something better. And so the question is then, okay, NXT 2.0, what does that offer better? Um, and then, you know, the only thing you can really say is scalability, uh, because all the other extra features that Jean-Luc says will be part of it, you can also do without splitting up the currency. Like, for example, making it so that when you launch your own currency in NXT, that you, can, um, uh, that you don't need NXT anymore, but can pay transaction fees with your own currency this you can do without splitting NXT so so as I understand it almost all of these things can be done without splitting NXT except for the scalability so 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 but there I think it's just like scalability first of all is not a problem today and eh? it's really nice to have that problem as Bitcoin has today but we don't have that problem and we're not even close and and so it's not important to do right now and it will likely be like it's 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 but also scalability if you need to address it you need to address it in such a you need to solve the problem without chasing away uh, users uh, the, the all objective is to have more users so you should do it in such a way that that you don't chase away current users um, I don't know how to solve that, I'm not a programmer, but this is just not the right solution and not the right time, I think. But, um, so I think it's very important for NXT to just very clearly uh, cancel this idea and make sure that the asset, issue, you, asset issuers that are planning to leave, uh, that don't leave. And, and um, we need to really change the insecurity that is being created and that we all as a community are creating. Like some people propose to um, uh, create more currency, uh, uh, do an IPO, I ICO, 
like this is all like goes against the fundamentals of NXT to have a limited supply of currency of 1 billion. We need to find other solutions to solve our problems than to really like break down the fundamentals uh, because we are building a currency, we are building a platform as well. And so stability is crucial. Eh? And just proposing dramatic changes is that seem to be taken serious by the leading people in the community and by a big people like that, that, that on sich is already too much. We need to really start like acting uh, much more responsibility. And that's me included, of course. Um, so, 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 um, unless, eh, of course, unless we want to eh, like throw away what we have and, and start over, but then we need to have a perspective to, to have a lot more users. Like for example, there is one guy, Desert Twin, half a year or a year ago, he proposed to look, uh, forget about it. We just need with NXT, you need, we need to uh, offer a free uh, VPN. Uh, to, to, and that's NXT, a free VPN, and we promote it everywhere. And, uh, and probably he means that NXT currency is a part of it, but it's just a small software program. And we're gonna like make sure that a lot of people want that because it's a free VPN. That's another approach as possible. Eh? And then I agree to kick out uh, the current um, asset exchange and all that. But that's only when there is a plan and a perspective to have a lot more users. Eh? But that's not part of NXT 2.0 right now. It's just scalability and it's all up in the air whether we will attract more users. And, and so I don't think that's the case. And We've been wrong about this too many times before thinking about, oh, and now we get the marketplace that will attract a lot of users, or we get the monetary system, we get a lot of users, but in the past it has proven that the way Jean-Luc releases these soft, big software updates, is it's not good enough to attract new users because it's not user friendly enough. And also the marketing is not well aligned. We don't do a good job there. Normally you start really selling something in advance. You promote it in advance. You have to line up a lot of people already before it is released. And then when it's released, you have a lot of people, if it's released well, uh, uh, that will start using it. So there is just no perspective here. This is gonna work out because NXT 2.0, there is even like this past, past, Updates like the marketplace, almost everybody agreed. Like, okay, that's something good. We, we we will likely attract more users. So people were promoting it, but nobody is promoting NXT 2.0 anymore because uh, what's what, what what can we say? Uh, it's, it's gonna scale more. Like I, I, it's for me. It's 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 just like no, I I can't promote it anymore because in the past I've promoted so much and it didn't really like pan out. So so. So, 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 yeah, we really need to change direction here. And so I think also something very important is that, um, uh, actually someone made a great post just today. I fully agree with everything he says that we need to stick with what we have and just make it much more user friendly and, 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 and all that. I fully agree with him. I have some other just ideas to add to that. I will link his post below the video. But I think proof of stake is also means the power is to the stakeholders. This is something we also need to change. That um, it's can no longer be that Jean Luc decides what happens with NXT, or that uh, people in the marketing team are talking with business leaders or, or, or with businesses. Just like and, and, and we as stakeholders, just it's just all happens to us, and we don't even get to know what they are doing it's a, like they lead we follow but that's just not 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 how it should be um it's good to have leaders but they need to like work for the shareholders they work for the coin holders eh? um and so that means that they, they, they have to like say what they're gonna do. Eh? They have to promise a, a, a beautiful future and they have to deliver on that beautiful future. Eh? And otherwise they get fired and we hire new people. Eh? And, and so that means that um, for Jean-Luc, like he needs to be um, like, come with up, come up 
with uh, with with some something that he thinks should be changed to NXT uh, for the better and why it's better and how it will attract more users and then he can uh, like if we all agree he can execute that the same with marketing eh, like the people uh, of the NXT foundation eh, eh, uh, if they have a plan to market NXT, okay, and they, okay, yeah? but also, so, so I think we should set up, like other coins do, uh, a sort of um, 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 foundation. We have a foundation, but it's not, uh, it's not owned by stakeholders. We should set up a foundation or change the NXT foundation so that the stakeholders decide, yeah? and um, they decide by majority vote, eh, but based on how much stake you have um, about the future of NXT. And we also need, of course, a payment model. Eh? We need to pay people that work for NXT. And there we have di different choices of business model. You can create more coins, eh? but I don't think that's a good solution because it's a real strong selling point for NXT to have a limited supply and just for cryptocurrency in general, a limited supply. And so we need to find other ways. And 